They're some of the most remarkable documents in the history of science. So when Darwin's diaries went missing from a strong room 20 years ago after being removed for photographing, there was universal dismay, with Cambridge University Library concluding they'd probably been stolen rather than misplaced. But last month, as mysteriously as they vanished, the two notebooks resurfaced in a gift bag on the library floor. Inside this printed message saying, Librarian, Happy Easter, X. There have been tears. There have been tears, and I think there still will be because we're not over the emotional roller coaster. It means so much to us to have these home. Like many other buildings, we don't have CCTV in places where people are just regularly just passing through. Our CCTV uh, monitors the front of the building, it monitors the back of the building. So we have passed the CCTV that we have available to the police, and that's a matter for their live investigation. Darwin sketched his ideas about an evolutionary tree in 1837 after a trip around the world. More than two decades before he published a more fully developed tree of life in his groundbreaking book on the origin of species. I honestly think, I mean, the, the theory of natural selection and evolution is probably the single most important theory in the life and earth environmental sciences. And this, these are the notebooks in which that theory was put together. The library says the notebooks are in good condition and haven't been handled much. Whoever took them and decided to return them appears to have looked after them with care. A police investigation into the disappearance of the notebooks worth many millions of dollars is ongoing. The mystery of Darwin's diaries is anything but an open and shut case. Neve Barker, Al Jazeera.